Oh my gosh, hello! Hello, hello, hello. And hello again to you. So I did a video earlier, and it was good. I mean, it was good because as I was doing the video, like a city truck came up, and they were checking out the cozy cabin. And of course, if anybody comes around the cozy cabin, of course you want to check it out. Hello, 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 cozy cabin. I mean, like, hello, I'd want to check it out if it wasn't my beautiful cozy cabin. <clears throat> but anyways, I started thinking to myself, like, is he going to give the cozy cabin a ticket? Because she's supposed to be in the fresh wilderness instead of the side of the street. And then I think he thought that I was videotaping him, so he left. But the good thing is, is I was videotaping him. It was, like, perfect. And then these birds came by, and it was all so cool and entertaining and then um yeah i listened back to it because the wind was blowing and there was no audio whatsoever and i gotta figure that out on my iphone you know i look to see which speaker where's the speakers are on the bottom but it's not really working so how are you hearing me right now you ask you did ask that right let me show you. Can you see it? Can you see it? Hmm, where could it be? It is right here. Yo! I don't even know, like, how to do it. I keep putting it on my lapel or whatever you want to call it, and it doesn't work for shit. So here I am saying S H I T. Every time I say S-H-I-T or F-U-C-K or any of that stuff within the first couple minutes of my video, for some reason, nobody sees my videos. So I don't know if they're like not putting it out there or I don't know, but I got to really work on my uh, swearing, I guess you could say. Luke, I am your father. Wow, 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 wow. Check out what that sounds like a little later. Sorry if that might have hurt your ears, but uh, I want to keep doing it. I actually want to do it right now again. <laughs> Anyways, quick story about last night. As you all know, um, and if you're just catching up, I do not have my storage. It's going for um, auction the end of November. I'm not going to worry about it today. I'm not. I'm not going to cry about it today. Nothing. Nothing. I will not do it. So, um, one of my sons, when they left, when the movers left uh, all of my stuff behind, um, he doesn't have a car. I mean, he has a car, but he doesn't drive. So, um, his partner brought him down there and they got a couple of our boxes that they thought was going to be important. One was Christmas boxes and another one was another little box that ended up having my jewelry in it. Um, my case of five phone case I wanted so bad. I don't know. I don't know. I'm like a, case, a phone case freak. You know, I might have a piece of shit phone, but I like cool phone cases and stuff. <clears throat> and my switch dock was in there. Yes. So, um, last night I decided that I was going to take it to the top of the mountain where they live. And it's not like the top of a mountain, but it's just all rock. So you kind of slide like, psh, 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 psh. and I took it all up there and then they had gone to Costco. So they had like, you know, the hundred pack things of water. So I said, Oh, I'm going to take some of these up here as well. And, um, yeah, I've been damaged the whole entire day. I couldn't sleep last night. I have a horrible back problem that I don't take medication for that I'm supposed to have surgery on. And yeah, 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 yeah. I'll talk about that at another time. Um, but I'm always in a lot of pain, but not like this. This has been the third time. What, how long have I been doing this? Seven months or something? The third time where my back's been so bad, like so bad. And there's nothing you can do about it because they'll just tell me to get surgery. And what are you going to do? Go down to the hospital and say, my back hurts. First thing they're going to say is, oh, you're a drug addict. You can't have any have any medication. So for people that really do hurt, nothing, it's not even going to matter. You know, it's just the way that the world is now. So I am not going to waste my time on anything like that. 
Anyways, when I'm bringing these boxes up there, you know, I tell myself, don't even look in them. Don't even look in them because you're just going to be sad, you know, with that. You don't have a home for Christmas. Well, I have the cozy cabin. Hello. Oh, yeah. I mean, but you're not going to have all your kids with you and, you know, the festivities of Christmas, you know, opening up all the cool presents and stuff, you know, and I'm not going to cry. So I'm going to stuff myself. Uh, anyways, <clears throat> I saw their stockings. Ugh. I just saying that is making me want to cry. So I'm not going to do it. I'm going to be strong when I say this. I saw their stockings. And then, of course, tears started falling. My heart broke like a son of a gun thinking, you know, feeling like, you know, I've lost everything when that's not true. Um, I still have so much to be grateful for. And then I decided, you know what? You can just put it up in the cozy cabin. I mean, I'd show you right now, but it's real dark in there, so you probably can't even see. I'll just put it there and pretend like it's Christmas. And then a little later, I was like, looking at it, I'm like, you can't do something like that. <laughs> so I just had to adjust myself to the whole situation, put myself right back into the present moment and just... Here, I'm going to fucking cry again. And just be grateful that I have these things. And who knows, when Christmas comes, I might even be so much more healed that, you know, maybe I'll be able to go live or something, you know. <sighs> Everything's a problem, you know. Everything just seems to kind of be a roadblock all the time. I really would like to go live. Um, I'd like to go live and decorate the trees outside with y'all or something, but... Um, I mean, who knows? Anything could happen. Um, yeah, but I, I like to play Charlie Brown Christmas. And hopefully, I'll get to that place where I can do something like that when I put everything up and just try to dance. I mean, it's probably not going to happen, but anything can happen. I mean, look at, I was homeless for like, what, a million years. And now I have the cozy cabin for like, what, three weeks, maybe. So I have a home and it's just going to get better from there. Um, I have gone to a couple of food banks. I'll probably do a story time about that because one of the ones that I went to, um, which was the second one, um, I was under the impression for what I read that. I could do service and get paid there, even though I don't want to do service and get paid. But I mean, like, what am I going to do without money? Um, and that um, was a no go. And I'll kind of tell you a story, a story time about that, because it was very interesting. Oh, yeah. And it wasn't a very good food bank. I was surprised because I had to wait like an hour and a half. And um, yeah, it pretty much just has to be a story time. Anyways, it's eight minutes. I could keep going and going, do the story time about that, you know, and everything else. I don't even know how my mic's going to be in this video. I really don't even care. I'm just going to upload it because I'm not going to do it again. As long as you can hear my voice a little bit, really, that's all that matters. Um, do you see it? Do you see it? Oh, is that the light or something? Look, it looks like there's a ghost right here. See it? It's like angel wings. No, I'm not on drugs. No, I'm not on drugs. If I was on drugs, I probably wouldn't cry all the time or anything. I couldn't even afford drugs if I wanted drugs. <laughs> Anyways, have a beautiful night. Thank you all so much for your kindness and support and not making fun of me, especially my teeth and my brain and my heart and how I cry all the time and, <clears throat> you know, cry all the time. Smile one second, cry the next. I guess that's just life sometimes, you know, so. I'm going to do my best on having a great night. And I hope you guys do too. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Okay, bye.